buddy. What do you got there? Hey, Jim. I bought a picture. I thought the place could use some brightening up. Well, good boy. For once in your life, you got a good idea. Give me the picture. You're right, this place could use some brightening up. Did you bring anything to hang the picture on? I thought we'd hang it on the wall. I know we're going to hang it on the wall. I mean something to hang it on, like a nail. Hey, Jim. What? I brought a nail to hang the picture on. That's what I mean. Here, hold that. Now we'll drive the nail into the wall, and then we'll hang the picture on the nail. Did you bring something to drive the nail into the wall with? Yeah, I brought two things. Jimmy, you can take your, your pick. Hmm. Give me that one. The red one? Yeah. OK, ready? Here we go. You broke it, Jim. I know I broke it. I can see that. Let me try that other thing. Hold it. Hold everything. Hold, hold, hold everything. There's something wrong here. There's something wrong, yep. What do you think? You think something wrong, Jim? Huh? Yeah. I think you're right. It's too low. Yeah. I didn't mean it was too low. Look at the point of that nail. Yeah, sure. It's pointing in that direction. And the head of the nail is pointing toward the wall. Yeah. Now, how are we going to drive the point of the nail into the wall? We can pick the wall up and bring it around this side to point. Oh, that's so dumb. dumb. You don't move the wall. You move the nail. Move the nail? Yeah. Now we'll move this nail right over here in this direction. And it'll come up against this wall. And now we're ready to knock it into the wall on this side. And a boy, Jim. Give me the hammer. OK. Wait a minute. Miss Mom. Now, the nail is right for that wall, but the hammer is right for that wall. The nail's right for that wall. The hammer's right for, for that wall. How'd you do that? I, uh, it was twisted. I unwound it. Good boy. OK, here we go. Right into the wall. And now we're ready to hang the picture. Oh, boy, Jim. I did it. You can do anything. Here's the hammer. Now you give me the picture. Go. Hang it right up here. On... That's the dumbest picture I've ever seen in my life. What is that? Dumb picture? What, what is that picture? Well, that's that's a bird. It's a bird. I know it's a bird. What's the bird doing? Flying. Flying. Look at the bird's wings. They're down by his side. Now, how can a girl bird fly without using its wings? The bird is sitting. What is the bird sitting on? That's the dumbest picture I've ever seen in my life. What is that bird sitting on? You tell me. Hey, Jim, the bird is sitting on the nail. Hey, Jim! Hello, buddy. Guess what I got? What do you have? I got another ironing board. I think this one is better than the old one. Good boy. That's wonderful. Bring it in here. Well, bring it in. Jim, we're in trouble. It's too big to get through the door. I tried to get it through the door, and this end hit that side of the door, and this end hit that side of the door. What are we going to do? How are we going to get it into the room? You just give it to me. You can't do anything right. I bet you can do it, Jim. Of course I can do it. Come on, Jim. You just walk in the room with the ironing board. You're right. It's too big. What are we going to do, Jim? Wait a minute. I got it. You got it. The ironing board is too big to get through the door, right? That's right. So what we'll do, we'll cut the ironing board in half, and then we'll just bring the two halves through the door. That's good. That'll do it. Okay, get me a saw. 
Okay. Well, you hold the board. Okay. I'll hold the board, Jim. Okay. And, and you, you do the sawing, okay? Right. Okay. Watch out for your fingers, boy. Watch out for fingers when sawing is done. Right yeah. through. Wow. You can really saw, Jim. Perhaps. Watch out for your fingers. And we're ready to go. You did it, Jim. Sure, I did it. Okay. Okay. Now you'll see how easy it is. Come on, Jim. You ready? Okay, come Watch on. this. Hey, Jim. Now, let's take this thing out now. The ironing board was too big, and we made it smaller. But it wasn't small enough. So let's make the doorway bigger. Okay? Okay. Oh! <laughs> hey! Okay, Jim, come on. I think we got it now. Come on, step up, try it. Well, I don't know. Yeah, come on, Jim. Think that'll fit? It's gonna well, work, sure Jim. Sure it will. For once in your life, you had a good idea. Thank you, Jim. Thanks Now so we'll just much. bring it right into the room. Yeah. You take the heavy end. Yeah. I'll take the light in, huh? and we'll just walk right into the room. Buddy and Jimmy together. Right. Walk right through the room. Right. You ready? Let's go. Let's go. That wasn't such a good idea after all. I don't know, Jim. We only go was too big. And we made it smaller. And it was still too big. So then I took the big hammer and I made the the door the doorway. I made the doorway bigger. Hey Jim! <laughs> hey Jim! Come here! What is it? I think we got it this time. What Stand in the middle, see? Yeah. Stand in the middle. With, okay. Hold on. Nobody over here. No Jimmy over here. Yeah. And it's gonna work, Jim. You think this will work? What do you think? I don't know. Okay, here we go, Jim. Okay. Oh. Hang on, Jim! Oh, what are you? Be careful! Here we go! Here we go, Jim! Oh, 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 oh. It's gonna work! We're gonna make it! It's gonna... Oh. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I told you I'd get it into the room! You did it, Jim! Of course I did it! But... I... You messed up the door, Jim. Oh, don't worry about the door. Now, we're gonna need those holes when we take our old lining board out! Hey, Jim, can I help you tidy the room up? Oh, thanks a lot. Um, why don't you put those shoes in the boxes that they came in? Put those shoes in the boxes they came that in? they came in. Okay, Jim. Thanks a lot. <clears throat> don't forget now, put one pair of shoes in each of the boxes. Right. One pair of shoes in each box. Good boy. All right. Hey, Jim, how many is a pair? A pair is two. You put two shoes in each of the boxes. Right. One shoe, one shoe, make a pair. Put the two shoes in the big box. Hmm. One shoe, and one shoe is another pair. And we put these in the little box. Jim, are you are you sure that these uh, are the right shoe boxes for the shoes here? Uh, sure, I'm sure. These are the boxes that the shoes can. I had a little trouble with this one here. You can't do anything right. Mm -hmm. Now I'll have to do it myself. And I watch very closely and try to remember how I do it. Will you? All right, I'll watch and I'll learn. Watch and you learn. It's a way to learn. It's very simple. I take these two shoes out of the big box yeah. and I put them on the table, right? That's right. Then I take the two shoes that are in the little box yeah. and I bring them way over here and I'm going to put them right in the big box. Was that hard? Well, you look at that. <laughs> ha! Well, you did it, huh? Sure I did it. Now all we have to no. do is take these two shoes and we put them right in the little box. 
wait a minute. I think there's something wrong here. I'm sure these are the boxes that these shoes came in. Wait a minute, Jim. Let me try. Look. Ha, ha, ha. Now. Buddy. What? What did you do that for? Well, Jim, now you've got them all mixed up and we'll have to start all over again. I thought that if we put this shoe with this shoe and put them in the big box <laughs> and put this shoe with this shoe and put them in the little box that... Well, I hope you're satisfied. You made a big mess of everything. Now we're worse off now than when we first started. Don't worry, Jim. Don't worry at all. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out, Jim, if it takes me a million years. I'll handle oh, this. Oh, forget about it. Since these shoes won't fit in the little box, you know what I'm going to have to do? I'm going to have to wear them out today. I'm sorry, Jim, that uh, you have to wear those shoes. Then. I did a lot of trouble with this box here. Hey, Jim. What you gonna do today, anyway? Today, I'm going to play tennis. Oh. Hey, Jim! I'm home! Okay, buddy, come on in, but don't slam the door. Hey, Jim. Look what you've done now. You knocked my girlfriend's picture off the wall. I just got here. When you slammed the door, my girlfriend's picture fell down. Oh, I'm sorry, Jim. Never mind that. You just put that picture back where it came from. Right. Oh. <sighs> hey, Jim. I forgot where it was. You can't do anything right. Now I'll have to figure this problem out all by myself. Uh, 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 uh. I think I got it. <laughs> yeah. Boy, she really brightens up the old room there, Jim. There's your girlfriend. Buddy, what's that in your hand? This is your girlfriend here. Mm. That wasn't such a good idea, was of it? Of course it wasn't. Now, I've got an idea. Yeah. Hey, come on, Jim! If I take this picture down... Yeah. I'll take this picture all the way over here, yeah. and I'll put that picture here. Yeah. But then, I'll have to take this picture down, and bring that picture all the way over to that picture. Or maybe I'll take all my girlfriend's hey, pictures Jim. down, and I'll put them all on that wall. Hey, Jim. Maybe I can... Hey, Jim. What is it? I got an idea. Let's break for lunch. For once in your life, you've had a good idea. <laughs> That's a wonderful idea. Thanks. Jim. We'll go get a sandwich, then we can come back to this problem with a brand new energy. Yeah. Let's go into the kitchen. Jim, let's go into the kitchen. Right into the kitchen. Here we go. Hold it, buddy. What is it, Jim? Don't take my girlfriend's picture into the kitchen. You might spill something on her. Oh, yeah. Well, Jim, what do, you, what do you want me to do with the picture here? I don't care. Just put it anywhere until after we've had our lunch. All right, good. Just put it anywhere until anywhere after we've all. had our lunch. That's right. All right. <clears throat> hey, Jim. Well, we got a tough problem today. Don't worry about our problem. I have all afternoon to figure this one out. You can do it, Jim. Uh, of course I can. buddy I'm coming Jim I'm coming hey Jim what is it tell me something will you what hey Jim Jim what do we got in the cart we got umbrellas in the cart what are what are, what are umbrellas for Jim well they keep you dry when it's raining out They don't work. Of course they work. Well, first you gotta open it. Oh! <sighs> well, 
Umbrellas don't work, Jim. I didn't mean open the cart, you dummy. You gotta open the umbrellas. If I open the, uh, an umbrella, it keeps the rain off me while it keeps me dry while, while, while it's raining? Sure, that's what I heard. I won't get wet? No. Nope. Hey, Jim. What is it? Would you help me find one that works? So, oh, all right. I'm getting wet, Jim. Hey, Jim. What? You know something? Umbrellas don't keep you dry when it rains. You know, I think there's something wrong here. What is it? I think you're supposed to unwrap them first. You see how all these umbrellas are all wrapped up? Why, sure. All right. Now, let's see what happens if we take the cloth off. Come on, Jim. Take the cloth. Yeah. Hey, Jim, you did it again. I certainly did. Hey, Jim! Hey, Jim! What is it, buddy? I got a surprise for you, Jim. Oh, boy. A surprise for me? Oh, what is it? I can't tell you what it is. If I told you what it was, it wouldn't be a surprise, Jim. I never thought of that. Hey, Jim, want me to unwrap it? Why don't you unwrap it? Hey, that's a good idea, Jim. Right. I'll unwrap it. You get great ideas, Jim. <laughs> Here we go! <laughs> it's a picture of me. Oh, boy. A picture of you? Ah, that's great. Our little room could sure use some brightening up. Yeah, you, Jim, you wouldn't believe it. I was walking down the street, minding my own business, you know, walking along, and all of a sudden I walked by the department store, and I just happened to look in the window, and there's this terrific picture of me. I couldn't pass it up. I said, I'll just take that, go in and bite and take it home and give it to Jim for a present. Well, I think that's great. Let me take a look. All right. Wait a minute. There's something wrong here. What? What's wrong? This isn't a picture of you. Well, it sure looks like me. This is a picture of me. Wait a minute. Let me see. Hold everything. I didn't notice this before. This is a picture of both of us. Oh, I'm sorry, Jim. Boy, just wait till I get a hold of the guy that sold me that picture. Hold it, buddy. I think this is even better. A picture of both of us. Buddy and Jim. Two friends, together, right here in the picture. That's a nice picture, Jim. Oh, it sure is. Buddy and Jim. <laughs> Jim, I'm sure glad you liked the picture. I'll see you later. So long, buddy. And thanks again for buying this great picture of Buddy and Jim. Two friends. Hey, buddy. Hiya, Jim. Oh, hello, buddy. What you doing? I'm just reading the newspaper. You know, it's a little dark in here. Would you put the light on, please? Sure. Yeah. Hey, Jim. I think the bulb blew out. I know the bulb blew out. I can see that. Well, don't just stand there. Get a new bulb. What are you doing with a light bulb in your pocket? If you put it in your shoes, they break. Uh, hey, Jim. You 
You want me to put the light bulb in no, for you? No, no, you just mess it up. I'll yeah. do it myself. I probably mess it up. You, you can probably do it. mess it up. Uh oh, this is too high. I can't reach it. What are we gonna do? You see that big box over there? You bring that big box over here. See? I'll stand on top of the box, then I'll be able to reach the light. That's good, Jim. I put the big box over here, yeah. under the light, and you're going to stand on top of it, then you can reach it. And I'll be able to reach the light. Oh, 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 something's wrong here. Wow, that's high, Jim. You know, if you it's can't so reach it, it's high. I never Boy. saw anything you couldn't reach. I got it. Do you see that other box over there? Yeah. Bring that box over here, put that box on top of this box, I'll stand on two boxes, then I'll be able to reach the light. That's smart, Jim. Yeah. Because if I bring that box over here and put it on top of the big box, and then Jim stands on top of both boxes, boy, you can reach that light bulb, sure, aren't you? Go get him, Jim. Okay. Bring the box over here. Yeah, okay. Okay, Jim. See ya. Little box on top of the big box, and then Jim is going to stand, stand on, on both the boxes, two boxes, and then it'll be so easy to reach it. Go get him, Jim! Uh, 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 uh. Wow. Boy, that's <laughs> higher than I thought it was. That's a high light bulb. I don't understand it. I brought the big box over here. <laughs> the box on top of the hey, big box. Hey, Jim. Box hey, it's, it's, hey, Jim. Do you know why you can't reach that light bulb? Why? The tops of your boxes are broken. No, they're not broken. Jim, they're broken. Get off and I'll show you. <sighs> the tops of your boxes are broken. Look at it, Jim. Look. See, the tops of the boxes are gone. What do you call that? That. The top of the box. Does that look broken to you? No, that's not broken, Jim. Well, then what are you bothering me for? I have to unscrew out this old bulb. And I have to get a real good grip on it. Okay? Now, buddy, you... Pick me up and turn me around. Oh, okay, Jim. Okay? Yep. You ready? Yep. Go. Oh. All right, turn me around. Okay. Okay, the bulb's out. The bulb's out? Uh, wow. Take the old one out, and we'll put in a new one. That's a real good, Jim. And when I get it into place, oh. you pick me up yeah. and turn me around. Okay. Go. No, 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 the other way. Oh, okay, Gotta Jim. Gotta screw it in. How you doing, Jim? All right, one more time. One more? There, we got it. Hey. Now, we got a new bulb. Wow, that's a new light bulb. That sure is. I told you I'd fix it. Jim? What? You know something? What? I think you could do most anything you want to do. You know something? Yeah. I think you're right. Okay. Now, I'm going to go back to reading my newspaper. Yeah? I want you to put the light on. You're going to read the paper? Sure. And old buddy's going to put the light on I for know. Jimmy. Right. Hey, Jim. I think the light bulb blew out. I know the light bulb blew out. I can see that. But don't just stand there. Get a new bulb. What are you doing with a light bulb in your pocket? If you put them in your shoes, they break. Hey, Jim. Want me to change the light bulb for you? Oh, no, you probably mess it up. I'll just yeah. do it myself. I'd mess it up, but you can do it, Jim. I can do it. You can do most... Hello, buddy. Hiya, Jim. What are you doing? Well, I'm making a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, Jim. Would you like... Would you like to see how a really great peanut butter and jelly sandwich is made? If you'd like to see it, would you like to see it? Of course I would. All right, you just watch now and you'll see how a great peanut butter and jelly sandwich is made. The first thing you do, Jim, is you take your peanut butter, you see? And you take the knife. And you take the knife and you put it, put the peanut butter on the slice of bread, you see? You watching? I'm right. watching. Oh, good boy. Then the next thing you do, Jim, is you put the jelly on the other piece of bread, you see? And then you spread it out just a little bit like that. And then you take the one piece, and then you take the other piece, and you put them together, you see? And then you've got... Hey, Jim. I 
think I did something wrong here. Of course you did something wrong. Look at that sandwich. Does that sandwich look right to you? Jim, the sandwich doesn't look right to me. It doesn't feel right either. Of course it doesn't feel right. You've got your fingers in the jelly yeah. and your thumb is in the peanut butter. Yeah. You know what you did? What? You made the sandwich upside down. Upside down? Hmm. What do I do now? That's simple. Yeah. All you have to do is turn the bread right side up. Turn the bread right side up. That's yeah, right. there we go. Right side up. Now and I got uh, your fingers in the peanut butter and the thumbs in the jelly. <sighs> it doesn't feel right either. Of course it doesn't feel right. You know what you did? What? You put the peanut butter and jelly on the outside of the bread. You're supposed to put it on the inside of the bread. Supposed to put it on the inside. Of course. Wait a minute. How can you tell what's the inside of the bread? The bread's not marked. Do I have to show you everything? Here. Now you watch real close. Yeah. Right in here, between the two slices, is the inside of the bread. Will you look at that? That's the inside. That's of the, bread. the inside. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, what I do now? What you do now is you have to take the peanut butter and jelly off the outside of the bread and you got to put it on the inside of the bread. Take the peanut butter and jelly off the outside of the bread and you take the peanut butter off the... Uh, I uh, broke the sandwich here, Jim. Of course you broke the sandwich. You can't do anything right. You know what we're going to have to do now? What, Jim? Make a whole new sandwich. New sandwich? Sure. But this time, I'll help you. Will you help me, Jim? Sure, I will. Oh, boy, I'm hungry. All right. Yeah? First thing we do... First thing. Is ...take two brand new slices of bread. Good boy. And we open the slices until we find the inside. That's the inside and of the that's bread. That's the inside. Now all you do is put the peanut butter and jelly on the inside. Put the peanut butter on the inside of this piece mm -hmm. and put the jelly on the inside, inside of this piece. piece. Hey, and then you just take the two pieces and you put them right together, hold, right? Hold, hold everything. Hold, hold everything. What is it? You remember what happened the last time you put the two pieces together? You ruined the sandwich. Yeah, I messed that one up. Of course you did. Yeah. This time I'll have to help you. You're going to help me, Jim? I'll help you. Ha <laughs> ha. This is go. teamwork. Teamwork. Buddy and Jim together. I'm going to take this piece of bread. Yeah. I'm going to stand over here with the jelly side facing you. Yeah. Now, you know what you're going to do? No, you're, you're going, going to tell take, me. You're going to take your piece of bread, you're going to stand over there with the peanut butter side facing me. Like this? Right, like that. Yeah. And we're going to aim, Yeah. and we're going to walk together until the two pieces of bread come together, and it'll make a whole sandwich with the peanut butter and jelly on the inside of the bread. Hey, Jim. What? You know what we're going to have? We're going to have a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Here sure. we go. Now, take aim. Take aim. On your mark. Here we go. Get set. <laughs> go. Buddy. Yeah, what is it? Buddy, you missed. There was a strong wind there, Jim. You can't do anything right. Here, give me that slice of bread. There you I'll go. have to do everything myself. All right. Just put this slice on top of that slice. Uh-oh. There's something wrong here. Yeah. This sandwich is only half right. I knew it. It can't be done. It's impossible to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I knew it all the time. It's impossible to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Of course it is. Wow. Boy, I sure am hungry. Jim. Got an idea, Jim. Look at this, Jim. I'm going to take this piece of bread and put it on top of this piece, and I got it. Triple Decker peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Hey. For once in your life, you've had a good idea. Good boy. <laughs> That's the best looking sandwich I've ever seen. That looks good. Oh, it sure does. Hungry. Mmm, mmm. That's the best peanut butter and jelly sandwich I ever did taste. <laughs> Why don't you make yourself one of these? Jim, I got the win.
tremendous for the holes in the wall. Good boy. Are you sure you got the right one? Oh, yeah, Jim. I got a square window for the square hole in the wall and a round window for the round hole in the wall. <laughs> What's the matter? <laughs> you don't think your old buddy knows what he's doing? We'll soon find out. All right. Let me see this window. Mm -hmm. Bring it right over to the That's wall. That's it. Uh-oh. What's the matter, Jim? Wait a minute. Wait a minute? There's something wrong here. Something wrong? What shape is that hole in the wall? Jim, that's a square hole in the wall. And what shape is the window you bought for it? That's a round window, Jim. Come over here. Okay. What shape is that hole in the wall? Jim, that's a round hole in the mm -hmm. wall. Mm -hmm. And what shape is the window you bought for it? That's a square window I bought for Jim, what are we, what are we going to do now, Jim? I've got an idea. Good boy. Pick up this window. Hey, Jim, what you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm trying to bend the square window so it'll fit into the round hole in the wall. Ha <laughs> ha! Good idea, Jim. Hold it. What is it? If I do that, the glass might break. Oh, that's a bad idea, Jim. <sighs> What are we going to do now? There's only one sensible thing to do. Uh-huh. I'll have to saw out the whole wall. And then I'll lift up the wall, and I'll turn it all the way around until the square hole is on that side, and the round hole is on that side. Whew. But that'll probably take me all day long. All day, because that's the biggest wall in our room. And this never would have happened, buddy, if you had gotten the right windows for the right holes in the wall. Boy, oh boy. Hey, Jim! Surprise! What's this surprise? <laughs> hey, Jim, when I was at the hardware store, I couldn't remember exactly which window was which, you know, so I got, I got another pair of windows exactly the opposite, see? So, look, hold that. Now I got a square window for the square hole, huh? 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 <laughs> then I got a round window for the round hole in the wall. So, square window for the square hole in the wall, round window for the round hole in the wall, and even got two round windows that we don't even need. Mm. Mm. You can't do anything right. What are we gonna do now, Jim? I think I can figure this one out. Yeah? Come on, Jim. All we'll have to do is to take the two wrong windows back to the store where we got them, and then I'll get my money back. You did it again, Jim. Of course I did it again. Now let's take the wrong windows and let's go to the store. Come on, buddy. Boy, take the wrong windows right back to the store and get our money back. Boy, that Jim sure is smart. Wish I was as smart as Jim. Jim. What is it? What is this thing? This is a seesaw. Oh, yeah. This is a seesaw. Seesaw. Jim, what does a seesaw do? A seesaw goes up and down. Kidding, seesaw? Ah, too bad. What's too bad? But this seesaw is broke. This seesaw is not broken. It's not going up and down, Jim. Everybody knows that you have to sit on a seesaw first before it can go up and down. Oh, I see. Good. Yeah, I'll show you. All right. <laughs> Very I, simple. I'd like to see you do some seesaw in here, Jim. Well, I'll show you right now. <laughs> Come on, Jim. Sit down on the seesaw. 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 Hey, Jim. I knew it. This seesaw is broke. Hold it. I think you need two people before the seesaw can go up and down. You gotta have two people two before people the seesaw goes the seesaw up and down? Before it can work. Jim, buddy, one, two, two people. That's Let's fine. go, Jim. Here we go. Whoopee, seesaw. Let's go, Jim. <sighs> buddy, 
I think you're right. I think this seesaw is broken. Mm. I sure wanted the seesaw, Jim. Me too. Hey, Jim. I got an idea. Maybe just one end of the seesaw won't work. Maybe we we're sitting on the bad end. Let's go over there and try the other end and maybe we can seesaw. Buddy, for once in your life, you've had a good idea. Good, good boy. boy. <laughs> All we have to do is go on the other end yeah. and then the seesaw. Seesaw, okay, here we go. Here we go. It's a good idea. Thank you, Jim. Now I sit down. Yep. Buddy sits down. Uh-huh. Now hold on real tight because sometimes the seesaw goes high. Real high, huh? Are you ready? Yeah. On your mark. Let's go. Get set. Here we go. Hold it. There's something very wrong here. I've got an idea. Yeah? I think you have to use both ends of the seesaw before it can work. Both ends? Both ends. I'll tell you what. Yeah? I'll stay on this end of the seesaw. Yeah? You go way over to the other end of the seesaw and you sit on that end. And then I think the seesaw is going to work. Good boy. Good boy. Here we go. Jimmy, stay on that end, will you? What I'll do is I'll go over here on this end, and we'll get this seesaw to... <sighs> seesaw. Damn. My end of the seesaw is too high. You can't get on my end of the seesaw, Jim. Uh, you can't do anything right. Jim is too high. You I can't get on it. All by myself. Does that look too high to you? Uh, it's not too high, Jim. Now sit down here and remember what I told you. You're going to sit on this end. I'm going to sit on this end, and then I think the seesaw is going to work. You're right, Jim. You always have the good ideas, Jim. You always have the good ideas. are you doing on my side of the seesaw? Oh, I want to seesaw with you, Jim, before it broke again. Hey, Jim! Hello, buddy. <laughs> what is it, buddy? What are you so happy about? My new jacket, Jim. You like it? Huh? Huh? That's a fine-looking jacket. <laughs> Thanks, what Jim. What a beautiful jacket. Turn around, buddy. Let me take a look at it. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Buddy, huh? Did you by any chance buy that jacket at Ralph's clothing store? How'd you know that, Jim? I know that because the jacket still has a great big label on it. A what on it? A label? No label on my jacket, Jim. There most certainly is. And you know what the label says? What? Turn around here. The label says, shop at Ralph's Clothing Store, right on the back of your jacket. I can't see any label. Of course you can't see it, because the label's not on your front, it's on the back of the jacket. On the back? On the back. I can't see the label, Jim. <sighs> Buddy, believe me when I tell you it's there. Now, if you'd like, I'll help you take the label off the jacket. Wait a minute. What is it? You can't take it off because if it's real pretty, I might like that label and I want to keep it on the jacket and wear it. So you can't take it off until I see the label. Well, that's up to you. 
Only one problem, Jim. What is it? How am I going to see the label? You can't think of anything by yourself, can you? Let me see now. I've got an idea. Good boy. All we have to do is walk you over to the mirror. Yeah? Then you'll just look in the mirror, and then you'll be able to see the label that's on your jacket. Mm-hmm. You sure are smart, Jim. Come with Jim. All right, here we go. Look right in that mirror and tell me what you see. <laughs> I don't see the label. Well, of course you can't see the label because you're facing with your front to the mirror. The label is on the back. So all you have to do is turn with your back to the mirror and then you'll be able to see the label. Hey, Jim. What? I can't see the label. There's something very wrong going on here. You face with your front to the mirror because the label wasn't on the front. Then you turn with your back to the label. Now, if the label's on the back of your jacket... You hey, hey, Jim! What is it? I got it figured out. What? I can't see... Uh, uh, I can see the front, but there's no label on it, right? Right. The label's on the back. Right. If I take the back of the jacket and put it around into the front, then I'll be able to see that label. I'll take me a good look at that label then. Hmm. Buddy, for once in your life, you've had a good idea. Thanks, Jim. Good boy. <laughs> take the jacket right off and we'll oh, do yeah. what you say. <laughs> Take it right off, and we'll put it off the way that old buddy said. <laughs> All right. And fix the collars. <clears throat> there. What's that? Huh? That's one of the prettiest labels I ever saw in my life. It certainly is. That label is so pretty, I'm going to leave it on the jacket, and I'm going to wear it everywhere we go. Good boy. <laughs> you did it again, Jim. Well, of course, I told you I'd do it. <laughs> You ready hey. to go for a walk, buddy? Sure would like to go for a walk now. Let's go. Oh, hold it. What? Buddy. What? You can go for a walk looking like that. You have to take your jacket off and put it on the right way. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Take the jacket right off. So it'll look nice and pretty for the walk that Buddy and Jim are going to take together as two friends. Mm hmm Oh, that's a great looking jacket. Thanks, Jim. You ready to go for a walk? Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Boy, you think uh, the people on the street will notice me today, Jim? Of course they'll notice. That's a beautiful jacket. Oh, uh, thanks, Jim. Well, here it is, buddy. Here's the wall. Just the place we left it yesterday. Yeah. We did a good job painting this wall yesterday, oh, Jim. Oh, we sure did. It's this side it... looks great. And you know what? What? Today, the other side's going to look great, too, because we're going to paint the other side today. Ha, ha. Let's go. Let's go. Jim. Something's wrong. We can't paint the other side of the wall because it's on the other side of the wall. Don't you think I can see that? What are we going to do, Jim? Very quiet. Jim is thinking. I got it, Jim. All we got to do is pick the wall up and turn it all the way around, then the other side of the wall will be over here, and then we can paint it, Jim. <laughs> That's the silliest idea I've ever heard in my life. You can't pick that wall up, it's too heavy. Now think. The only way we can paint the other side of the wall yeah. is to reach over it. Good boy. Let's do it. Hey. All we have to Hey, Jim, you know, you can't reach over there far enough to paint that side of the wall. I know I can't. Why does the other side of the wall have to be on the other side of the wall? Hey, Jim, the only way to paint the other side of the wall is to go under the wall. All we have to do is dig a tunnel right under the wall, and then we'll go under it, and we'll be on the other side of the wall. <laughs> Funny, huh. that's your second silly idea in a row. Yes, yeah, it a... would take us all day long to tunnel under this wall. Yeah. Now think, buddy, use your head. Hmm. We're on this side of the wall. Use my head. Look out, Jim! Here I come! Oh, buddy, what? Hold it. What are you doing? Well, for once in my life, Jim, I'm gonna use my head. 
I'm going through that wall. <laughs> you can't go through that wall using your head. You're liable to break the wall. I've got an idea. Good boy. The only way we can get to the other side of the wall is by going over the wall. Oh, boy, you're really smart, Jim. Of course I am. Over the wall, that's it. Right over the wall. Honey <laughs> and Jim. Right. Give me a hand. Right. I don't mean that kind of a hand. I mean, help me get over the wall. Oh, yeah. Here we go, Jim. You ready? A little help over little the wall. Help. Buddy and Jim. Oh, there we go. Now. How you doing now, Jim? I'm okay so huh? far. I'm halfway huh? there. Halfway there. Halfway. I'll give you a little help, Jim. Jim, want to help me over the wall? Of course I'll help you. All right. Here comes Buddy on the Here other side buddy. of the wall with Jim. Pull Buddy right over. Right. Yeah. Get me help me down here. Okay, okay buddy. All right. Oh! Jim, on the other yeah, side of the wall. I told you I'd do it. You did it, Jim. Of course I did. Now we can paint the other side of the wall. Let's paint the wall right now. Right. Jim, paint's on the other, over there. I tell you, don't worry about a thing. Old Buddy will go right over the wall and get the paint and bring it back over Hold here. Hold everything. What? You can't do anything right. Huh? I'll have to do it all by myself. Right. Give me a hand. Right. Here we go. All right. Take it easy. Oh, hold it, Buddy. What? All right. All right. Uh, How you doing? I'm okay. All right. Real Careful hard now. Over this wall. Don't fall, Jim. All right. Don't want to hurt yourself. Huh? <laughs> all right. Here we go. Here we go. Oh. Yeah. Hey, you are, Jim. <laughs> Okie doke. Thought you might hurt yourself there for a minute. So I had to come and help you. Hold everything. Huh? Buddy, huh? how did you get on this side of the wall? Oh, like this, Jim. See, you were going to fall off, and so I said, well, boy, I can't let Jim fall. So I came over and helped you down. You mean to tell me that you figured out the easy way to get to this side of the wall and you let me go the hard way? Jim, I didn't figure anything out. It just happened, Jim. All right, don't worry about it. Pick up the paint can and we'll go and paint the other side of the wall. Buddy and Buddy Jim, Jim gonna painting together. paint the other side of the wall. Hold mm. everything. Mm -mm -mm. This time, Jim goes the easy way around the wall, and Buddy goes the hard way over the wall. That's a good idea, Jim. Yes. You take the easy way around the wall. Buddy takes the hard and way. And Buddy will take the hard way over the wall. Mm -hmm. All right, well, we're going to do a good job on it. Painting this old wall today. <laughs> Hey, Jim! What is it now, buddy? Jim, I... I got some good news and I got some bad news. What's the bad news? I knocked the can of paint over it, Jim. Oh, no. But I got some good news. What is it? We forgot to put paint in the can in the first place. Have what I got something here? here? What is that? Ha, 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 ha. I really got something today, Jim. It's a paper glider that you can make yourself. I went to the store and the man says, you can take this home and make it yourself. And have fun, you know, flying the glider around the room. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> A lot of fun to fly gliders. Jim, I, I don't think I can make it by myself. 
you help me make it, Jim? All right, I'll help you make it. Good boy! <laughs> Good. First thing you need yeah. is the instructions. Instructions. Of course. What do you got there, Jim? These are the instructions. That's the first thing you need. First thing you need. Now we'll read. First, number one. One. Fold the paper in half. Fold the paper in half. Ha <laughs> ha. Next. Second. Number two. Two. Fold back the corners to form a point. Ha ha ha. Fold back the corners. One corner. Two corners. Point. <laughs> All right, let's go. Third, number three, fold each side in half. Fold each side in half. <laughs> Boy, this is going to be fun, Jim. I'm going to have some fun today. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> now. What, 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 what's next? Now I'm ready to fly the glider. Attaboy, Jim! It's a perfect <laughs> landing. Landed landing. right there on the field there. Of course it did. That's the way I planned it. <laughs> hey, Jimmy. What is it? I got an idea. What? <laughs> My turn to fly the glider. Well, that's a good idea. But I've got a better idea. Instead of taking turns flying this glider, why don't you make the other one? That's a good idea, Jim. <laughs> you can fly your glider and I can fly mine. Sure. <clears throat> hey, Jim. What? I can't make my glider. Why not? You've got the other piece of paper, haven't you? Yeah, but they didn't put any instructions on mine. Jim, what? what do you want to do today? Buddy, today I thought we'd play a game of checkers. That's a good idea, Jim. Sure it is. Now, why don't you pull up that other chair? Okay. Come over, Jim. <laughs> I'm going to beat you today, Jim. We'll soon see about that. Hey, Jim, there's something wrong with my chair. Buddy, there is nothing wrong with your chair. If you had any sense, you'd see that that chair was not made to go on that side of the table. It was made to go on this side of the table. So all we have to do is switch chairs. Wow. <laughs> there we go. Very simple. <laughs> Hold it. Where is Jim? Buddy, I think you're right. There is something wrong with this chair. I got an idea, Jim. What? All we have to do is to turn the table around. Huh? For once in your life, you've had a good idea. <laughs> good boy. There you grab go. the heavy end, I'll grab the light end. Right. Lift it up, and we'll turn it right around. And we go. Round and round. Boy, I'm sharp today, huh, Jim? It's a good <laughs> idea. <laughs> that chair is still wrong for the table. It wasn't such a good idea I had, was it? It's a terrible idea. Wait a minute. This chair is not facing this side of the table, right? Right. All we have to do is move the table over to that side of the chair, and then the chair will be facing the table. Wow. OK. OK, Jim. Oh. <laughs> here we go. Right down here. Right. In front of the chair. You did it again, Jim. Of course I did it again. Good boy. Oh, yeah, fix everything. <laughs> Hey, Jim. Jim? 
Hold everything. Get up, buddy. There's something very peculiar going on here. There's something wrong here, Jim. If we're going to play checkers, huh? the table has to be between the two chairs, right? Good boy. All we have to do is move the table between the two chairs, and we're ready to play checkers. That's it, Jim. That's the idea. You did it, Jim. I think I really did it this time. <laughs> OK. Ah. Let's move the table right in between the two chairs. What a nice game of checkers. And today. now we're going. That chair is still not facing this table. Well, that's it, buddy. It looks like we're not going to play checkers today. Not going to play checkers? I don't see how we can. Jim, I wanted to play checkers today. I don't see how we're going to do it. you do that well I... well never matter how you did it as long as you did it now we can get down to our checker game yeah finally boy it's gonna be fun to play checkers with you today Jim. all that what is it, Jim? oh there's something wrong here you know every time we play checkers i play with the red checkers jim always plays with the red checkers right what color are these checkers those are black checkers jim where are my red checkers the red checkers are right here in front of me what are we going to do now, Jim? I have an idea. All we have to do is switch the chairs around. That's all we have That's to all do. we have to do. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Very simple. <laughs> Jim. Hello, buddy. How are you today? I'm fine. Where are you going? I was just going out for a walk. Oh, you're going for a walk. Huh? Would you like to come along? Yeah. <laughs> you can come with me. Oh, thanks, Jim. But put on your coat. Oh, OK. It's very cold outside. Is it cold? Very cold. That's today. good, because I like to walk when it's cold, you me know? Too. Don't forget to button up your jacket. Oh, I'll button it up, because it's, uh, it's cold out there. Jim. What is it? Wait a minute. I just lost my buttonholes. You what? I lost my buttonhole. Buddy, huh? that's the silliest thing I've ever seen in my life. Yeah? You haven't lost your buttonholes. Where are they? They're right over here on the other side of the jacket. <laughs> there they are, of right course, there. Of course, they were there all the time. All right. Now button up your coat and let's get going. It's getting late. Hey, Jim. What is it now? Oh, yeah. See anything looks funny there? I lost my, uh... Where'd those buttons go, Jim? Buddy, hmm? you can't do anything right. No, uh, not me. Don't you know where the buttons are? No. Now the buttons are on the other side of the coat. <laughs> there. They were there all the time. The buttons were there all of the time. Of course. Now, to button your coat, yep. all you do is take the button, yep. and you push the button through the buttonhole, Button through the buttonhole, right. And then that's how you button your jacket. Right through You there. finish it up. Oh. And hurry uh, up, because it's getting very late. Yeah, here's the, there's a push the button right through the buttonhole. Just, uh, all you gotta do is push the, Jimmy. What is it now? I, um, uh, I lost one buttonhole and one button. Hold it. There's something wrong here. Something bad wrong here. We have a button here. Yeah? 
and no buttonhole for it. Nope. And down here we have a buttonhole, but there's no button. I've got an idea. I knew you would, Jim. Of course, this is very simple. <laughs> Good. All you have to do is you take the button with no buttonhole, right. and you get the little buttonhole with no button, and uh, what do you do? <laughs> you put the little button through the buttonhole, and we're ready to go. You did it again, Jim. Of course I did. Now, let's get going for our walk. You did it again. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hello, Jim. Hello, buddy. How are you? Fine. How are you today? You going somewhere? Yes, buddy. I thought I was going to go for a walk. Would you like to come? Boy, would I like to go for a walk today, Jim. Come on. I feel like a good walk today. Hold everything. What is it, Jim? Hold it. What is it? Look at your feet. Yeah. What's the matter with them, Jim? I just washed them. As a matter of fact, I took a whole bath. Buddy, that's not what I mean. What? I mean, look at your feet. Yeah? Didn't you just tell me you wanted to go for a walk with me? Sure would like to, Jim. Well, it's cold outside. You can't go out for a walk with your bare feet. Where are your shoes and socks? Oh, they're right there, where I left them. Well, go over and put them on so we can go for a walk. Oh, okay, Jim. Let's see here now. I really do feel like a walk. There's one shoe. And here's a sock. <laughs> Pretty socks. And here's another shoe on this foot. Hurry up, buddy. Okay. Hey, Jim, where are we going on the walk? I think if we go to the zoo today. Oh, boy, maybe we'll see that big elephant again, huh? He's still there. Yeah. Well, he was bigger than a parakeet last time I saw him. All right, I'm ready to go for a walk to the zoo. Let's go. Good. Wait, whoa, oh, something wrong, Jim. What is it, buddy? The socks are slippery. I almost fell down. Buddy. What? Look what you've done. You put your shoes and socks on all wrong. Wrong? Of course you did. You got a shoe and a sock and a shoe and a sock. You're supposed to put the sock on first, and then you put the shoe on after you put your socks on. You did it all wrong. Wow. Okay. Go back there and do it right. All right. Hurry up. It's getting late. Here we go. Hey, Jim. What is it? Maybe we'll see one of the zebras today, huh? We'll probably see two or three zebras, but you have to hurry up before the zoo closes. Right. You know something, Jim? You know what zebras have? What? Zebras have stripes. <laughs> you didn't know any of that, did you? <laughs> All right, now I got a sock on, another sock, and now I got a shoe on this foot and a shoe on that foot. Now. Ready to go. Let's go. Hey, Jim. What is it this time? Ooh! My shoes are attacking me. They hurt my feet. Wait a minute. There's what? something wrong here. Yeah, it's something real bad wrong with my shoes, Jim. Buddy. Huh? You've got your right foot where your left foot is supposed to be, and your left foot is where the right foot is supposed to be. Right? That's why your feet hurt. Is that why my feet of hurt? Of course that's the reason. Whoa, what are we going to do now, Jim? It's very simple. Simple? All you have to do is cross one leg over the other, and then your feet will be right. Really? Of course. It's very Let's simple. See. It's right over there, and now the shoes are where they're supposed to be. <laughs> Boy, you sure are smart, Jim. Let's go for our walk. All right. Ready now? Yep. Let's go. Let's go. Not too fast, though. Buddy. What is it? What's wrong? Well, nothing's wrong. I just can't go a little too fast there. You, you walk, take too big a steps for me, Jim. Wait a minute. What is it? There's something wrong here. What's wrong? Buddy. Uh-huh? You've got your shoes on the wrong feet. I've got my shoes on the wrong feet? Certainly. You have your shoes on the wrong feet. They're the only feet I got. That's not what I mean. I mean that you have your left shoe where your right shoe is supposed to be, 
and your right shoe is where your left shoe is supposed to be. Yeah? So what do I do now? You've got to go over there and put the right shoes on the right feet. Oh, okay. Hurry up. This is the don't last go time away, I'm going to wait for you. Right, don't go away. I'll be right with you. That's on the front. That's there. I think I got it, Jim. I think I got it this time. Put your right shoe on your right foot and your left, left shoe, shoe on your on left. the left foot. Ta-da! There you are. Ready to go. I'm ready to go. No, you're not. What's the matter? Look at your shoes. What's more? What, what's wrong? You forgot to tie your shoelaces. Mm. <laughs> well, let that slip, didn't I, Jim? Well, I'll have it undone in no time. Do you know how to tie a bow? Oh, yeah. Okay. Tie a funny bow here. There. That's a nice bow. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go to the zoo. Hey, not too fast, though. Hey, Jim, I'm not walking fast enough. I, I, I just don't think I can fix my feet. Jim, hey, Jim, can you fix my feet? Buddy, this time I don't think I can fix your feet. Jim can't fix my feet? Not this time, but I've got a better idea. Ah, good boy. You come outside with me now, yeah? and I'm going to teach you something. You know what I'm going to teach you? What? I'm going to teach you how to walk on your hands. You kidding? Right outside, I'll teach you how to walk on your hands. Come on. Now. You're going to yeah. teach me how to walk on my hands. Oh, boy. I can hardly wait. <laughs> Jim's going to teach me how to walk on my hands. Oh, boy. Hey, buddy, it's time for lunch. Come and get it. Mm-hmm. Boy, I sure am hungry today, Jim. Me too. What's for lunch, Jim? Today for lunch, buddy, we have good hot soup. Mm-hmm. Boy, that smells good enough to be soup, Jim. Okay. Now, what do you want, buddy? A spoon? or a fork. <laughs> I think I'll take a fork. Okay, Buddy has the fork and Jimmy has the spoon and now we'll have our soup. I sure am hungry. Oh, me too. Mmm, -hmm. that's good soup. Hey, Jim. Your soup good? Oh, it sure is. Best soup I ever tasted. Something wrong with my soup. What do you mean there's something wrong with your soup? That's your favorite soup. It's chicken soup. Doesn't have much taste. It doesn't have much taste? Nope. Not much taste to my soup. Let me have a taste of that, and I'll tell you if it has any taste or not. Well, I can tell you already. I tasted it. It doesn't have much taste, Jim. See? Buddy, what, what are you talking about? That soup is delicious. This soup is delicious. Of course it is. Now, eat your lunch. Come on. Mm. Smells delicious. Of course, because it is delicious. Mm. Something wrong with my soup, Jim. It doesn't have much taste at all. Buddy, mm. hold everything. Your soup and my soup came out of the same pot, right? Yeah, I saw you dip it out. Of, of course I part. did. Now, my soup is good. That means that your soup has to be good. That means my soup has to be good. Of course it is. Now, eat your soup. Boy, I hope it's good. Mmm, mmm, it's good soup. Mm. Jim. What is it now? Something's wrong with my soup. And you say your soup is good? It sure is. They both came out of the same pot, right? Same pot. The only difference is you're using a spoon and I'm using a fork. Maybe there's something wrong with my fork. Hmm. Hold everything. What is it, Jim? Your soup and my soup came out of the same pot, right? That's right. Buddy? What? I think there's something wrong with your fork. Wow. You sure are smart, Jim. Of course I'm smart. It's what very we... simple. We'll just get rid of the old fork, yeah, but what we and do we'll now? get you a new fork. <laughs> Boy, you sure do take care of me, don't you, Jim? That's because you're my best friend. Oh, thanks, Jim. And I'll tell you what I'm going to do. 
What's that? To make sure your soup is good, yeah. I'm gonna give you my bowl, and you give me your bowl. Boy. Thanks a million, Jim. You're welcome. You have my bowl, and I have Buddy's bowl. You now, really do take care of Buddy, don't you, Jim? Of course I do. Now eat your soup. I'm sure I'm hungry now. Mm -hmm. Mm. Is soup good, Jim? Oh, it's the best soup I ever tasted. You sure do take care of Buddy. Maybe I'll make myself a nice peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Let me see now. I'll take the tape. Good boy! Press it down real good. Yeah. And now... Buddy. Buddy, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting around, Jim. <sighs> Buddy, what is that? <laughs> Come on, Jim. You know what that is. That's your finger. <laughs> I don't mean my finger. I mean, what is that on your forehead? Oh. That's my money. And why is your money on your forehead? So I'll know where it is. That's a nice, safe place to keep money. <sighs> that is the silliest thing I have ever heard in my life. <laughs> Buddy, that's no place to keep your money. Sure it is, Jim. Right there. That's a safe place. Buddy, can't you think of another place to keep your money than your forehead? Well, to tell you the truth, Jim, I did worry about that. I tried. Matter of fact, I tried first pasting it across my eyes like that. But you know, it's a problem when you do that. You keep bumping into things. Mm. That's not what I mean. I mean, can't you think of a safe place? Think. It's very important. Safer than here? Safer than there, sure. There's got to be a safer place than that to keep your money. Well, that's going to be a tough one. Let's see now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, hold everything. Uh-oh. Aha. Uh-oh. Buddy, what is this? Oh, Jim, that that's a piggy bank. There it is. Matter of fact, you know, that's that's about the safest place in the whole world to keep things, you know, that you don't want to lose and you always know where they are. All you have to do is just drop them right in this little hole here in the top of the piggy bank, see? Mm -hmm. And then you got them on the inside. And if you want to take them out, you have a key, see? And you just take this key. Watching? Are you looking? I sure am. All right, you take this key and you just stick it right in the bottom, undo it, and then you take them out, see? Buddy, didn't you just finish telling me that this piggy bank is the safest place in the whole world to keep things in when you don't want to lose them? Jim, I just told you that. Well, you know what I'm going to tell you now? What? I'm going to tell you to take your money off your forehead and put it right into the piggy bank where it'll be safe and you'll always know where it is. Right in there. Safest place. Boy, Jim, you did it again. Sure That's did. right. All I have to do is take the oh, money so off my ahead. forehead That's it. and put it right in. There's a nickel. There's one nickel. Mm-hmm. A penny. A penny. And another penny. You got a lot of money, buddy. Oh, I got seven cents. That's a nickel and two pennies. Right there in the old piggy bank. Good yes, sir. boy. <laughs> now we know where they are. Anytime I want to take them out, Jim, see, mm -hmm. all I have to do, you know, I want to spend them with a little ice cream or something like that. I like ice Not cream. Not before your dinner, though. No, never before. <laughs> mm -hmm. When I want to take them out, all I have to do then is take the key and unlock the bottom and take my money out. Get your money. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Good boy. Then, <laughs> uh oh, Jim. What is it? What happens if I lose? How do I get the money out of the bank if I lose the key? Uh oh, buddy. For once in your life, you've had a good idea. We have to find a safe place to keep the key so you'll never lose it. That's it. We've got to find a safe place to keep the mm -hmm. key so I... Hold hmm. it. Hold it. Wait a minute. Jim's got an idea. No, uh -huh. no, no. Buddy's got the idea, Jim. What All you have to do is take this key right here, you see, and paste it right on the forehead. I, think I know where that is. That's right not a good there. idea. Times I have a better idea. All you have to do... To put the key in a safe place is to put it in the safest place in the whole world that Buddy and Jim know to keep things. Where is that? Where is it? I'll show you where it is. Give me that key. Oh. We're going to take the key and we're going to put it in the old safe piggy bank. That's it, Jim. That's the answer. You did it again. Sure. Oh, boy. Good boy. Okay, Buddy. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. Hey, Jim. What? I'll right, see you tomorrow. Okay, buddy. So long. So long. Boy, is he smart. Yep, he figured it out. Now I got the money in the piggy bank where it's safe, and I got the key in the piggy bank where it's safe. And now all I have to do anytime I want to take my money out of the piggy bank is just to take the key that's in there and... Oh, Jim. <laughs>